Good morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. Hello. Hey. Little girl. Good morning. How did you sleep? You did? You slept all day yesterday, too. You gonna sleep all day today? Yeah, probably. Are you guys ready to go? No. No? Well, we're leaving. Well, you can... I want my gummy eggs. Well, maybe if you're good. How'd you sleep, Melissa? Horribly. Why? Because it's very rolly here. It's very rolly. Very. Like, might as well just sail through the night, probably. Probably. Hudson, how did you sleep? Hudson. Hudson. Did you sleep good, bud? How did you sleep? We came in last night in darkness. That's what it looks like in the daytime. Yesterday was pretty fun. Sailed near a water spout. Got caught in a lot of heavy weather. Came in through that field of ships. Had to navigate around these buoys. And had to find a safe anchorage. Which we did. Can't go on shore, so we'll be staying out here until we go. We're gonna we're gonna leave in about 20 minutes, 15 minutes. So um, yeah, and we're gonna head on attack actually and try and get more east. We're gonna head to the next island. Um, for some reason, we lost our navigation lights last night. There will be no sailing at night until those get fixed. So we anchored at the base of a volcano. So pretty deep. Hit it. Good job. Now press the center button. Turn the alarm off. Now steer, uh, steer to starboard, which is your right. Yep. Yep. Going around. Right there. Hold the heading. Right there. Straight ahead. Good job. Go ahead and tighten up your jib. Yep. Yep, keep your heading though. Steer the wheel to the right. Yep. Keep going. Keep going. Hold it right there. Okay. Go ahead and crank the crank the deal. Yep. Good job. Look at me. You just steered the boat and got the sails out. Good job. Can I keep steering? 
You can keep cranking. Who would have thought when we ordered these that I would be drinking from them in front of a volcano in the Caribbean? Is that fun? Paddle, 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 paddle. Yeah. Who would have thought that we would have bought a sailboat and we'd have our own little captain to sail us around the Caribbean? That's right, Captain Scar. Captain Scar Scar. <laughs> All right, here we go. Take me to the next island, Captain. As soon as we made it out of the harbor, it was right back into the weather with 20 to 30 knots of wind. If the waves would die down just a little bit, I might just try my hand at fishing. What did you tell me before we left? That if you catch a fish while we're out here, I'll eat it. But why is that a big deal? Because fish makes you what? Grossed out. I don't like fish at all. She, she doesn't eat anything out of the ocean. But here's why. I don't, I'm not even worried because... Jake has never It was nice to get to Montserrat before dark. I definitely didn't want the same kind of situation I had the night before. There's no guarantee that you have an anchorage though, just because you get to an island. You have to call the Coast Guard and gain access. Because of COVID restrictions, they definitely don't want anybody going ashore. And they watch every boat that comes in like a hawk. After a little bit, our request was granted and we anchored in a nearby bay at just 15 feet of water. We were surrounded on three sides by the most beautiful white sandy beach I'd ever seen. And even if I wanted to go to shore, I couldn't. I had to get to bed early because there's a big day ahead of us. A 15 hour sail to Dominica. And if I wanted to get there before nightfall, I was gonna have to leave before daybreak.